What's going on? It's Salvaje and I'm back with another Save the World Quick Tips video. Let's talk about Boost. So I just want to let you guys know, over the next couple of days, I'm going to be making Save the World videos on all of the ideas that I've been saving up uh, for the free-to-play launch because the free-to-play launch is probably not going to happen anytime soon. So these two pages of Save the World video ideas, they have to go, boys. So let's talk about Boost. All right, there are two types of Boost in Fortnite Save the World. We have the XP Boost and the Teammate Boost. Should you be hoarding up on these boosts? No, not really. You can actually just use them as much as you want. How do you get more boosts? Well, you get more boosts by opening them up from mini reward llamas, which can be opened in the llama shop. I don't really think I have any mini reward llamas left. No, I had like... Oh, actually I do. I do have mini reward llamas saved up. No, I don't. No, I don't. I don't have any mini roar llama saved up. But the point is, you can get boosts from upgrade llamas, and you can also get boosts from the mini reward llamas as well. As you guys can see, this upgrade llama is going to give me a teammate boost, which means that I'm going to be boosting the experience that my teammates are going to be getting throughout the match. That's why you shouldn't really save up on your XP boost, and you should use them as much as you want. When you're first starting out in Fortnite Save the World, that's where you should be maximizing these boosts as fast as possible, because getting to level 310 your actual commander level is really important because as you level up in Fortnite save the world you're going to be unlocking gadgets let me actually take you guys to the gadget section in Fortnite save the world if I can find it if I can actually find it I'm not kidding I don't know where it is I forgot okay here we go it's in upgrades <laughs> I don't really use this section anymore I'm sorry but as you level up you're going to be unlocking uh, more gadgets uh, and more gadget upgrades in Fortnite Save the World. So when you're a beginner player, you absolutely want to make sure that you're using your boost as much as possible. The XP boost is going to help you level up faster, and the teammate XP boost is also really, really good as well. Uh, you can also use your boost in the middle of a match as well. So let's talk about the daily bonus XP. Basically, you go to sleep, and you log in to save the world the next day and the daily bonus XP is going to be available. This is basically an XP bonus that you absolutely want to capitalize on. So make sure that you're actually taking a break from Fortnite Save the World and you're not playing it non-stop. Okay? Also, let's talk about the account boost. If you are a Save the World founder, you are going to get a party XP buff, which gives bonus XP to party members when you have a boost active. Which means that you absolutely want to make sure that you use your XP boost and that you use your teammate boost and give it to your teammates like that of course everyone can get more xp specifically if you have a group of four people with the party xp buff so that's how boosts work in fortnite save the world and whether you should save them or whether you should not save them if you guys enjoy the quick tips video feel free to drop it a like and feel free to subscribe to join the salvaje cartel see you guys in the next one and more beginner videos in the description below peace